There's something in Islamic faith, it's called sira or temporary marriage. The temporary marriage, a man can marry a woman for a specific period of time, could be 15 minutes or 15 hours, 15 days, 15 years, for a specific amount of money. From biblical view, that's legalized religious prostitution. I want to share with you the story of Rita. Rita says, I was in such a temporary marriage because I was afraid to be alone and because of financial pressure. I was always afraid. What if I'm not in this temporary marriage? How can I take care of myself and I will be alone? I live with fear. Until one of my relatives shared Jesus with me, I gave my heart to Jesus. Then she told me, watch this channel. And I started watching your channel. Then I realized this temporary marriage is not of God. It's actually a sin that I need to repent from. But I was struggling. How could I live alone? Who would support me? But after I prayed with you, I felt so free. I went to my husband and told him, I cannot continue like this. I have become a Christian and what we do is sin. My husband got angry and he threatened that I will tell others about your faith in Christ and you will go to jail. Then he kicked me out. Then she says, I was always living in fear. I never thought that I could live alone. But today, with the power of Jesus, I'm able to live without fear and to live free from codependency. Now I know my identity in Christ. I have self-worth and live with dignity. I'm so proud to be a child of God. Then she says, I owe this happiness to Jesus first and then to you. I appreciate all your support and wish you the best. You know, when Rita says, I owe this happiness to Jesus, yes, he did the main work. He, he does it. He sets people free. And then she says, I owe it to Jesus and you. And when he, she says you, she doesn't mean just me. It means you too. Those who pray for us, those who partner with us, those who invest in this ministry. This is the result. This is the harvest. This is the fruit. This is the return of your investment. May I encourage you to continue supporting us. And if you're not supporting, consider joining us in transforming lives like Rita and transforming a nation. The gospel is powerful. When we work together, not only lives will be changed, the whole nation will be changed. Go to our website, be in touch with us, sign up for a monthly donation, and let's change Iran and change the world together. We can do it.